Hey there guys, it's Ryan Smith, back from Ryan Gamers, and today I'm presenting another video of Minecraft Rolls. So, today we will be looking at a tutorial that I'll be showing you of how to install custom mod packs and custom jars on the hosting service of Minecraft Rolls. So, I've made a video of this in the past, but it was not up to the mark. So, I'm going to elaborate it more over here, and hopefully if you will be able to understand it. If you have any problems, feel free to comment me, or if you are facing any difficulties in coping up with the video, just feel free to pause and just do your things. So please try to avoid disliking the video. If you just don't like it, just don't look at it. If it doesn't, if it doesn't help you, you can just give feedback from the comments so I can try to improve it next time. So let's get started. Keep watching. So coming to the main page of MinecraftRolls.com, you're gonna come to the server page. Uh, I uh, choose the Walker Clan, a free server for now, just for the sake of this tutorial. Then you click on Europe. I want to see Europe. You can also use America, but I prefer Europe for now since all of my servers are on America and there must be traffic at it. So let's try Europe and I'll name the server YouTube. YouTube.mtworlds.pro, okay. Now, when you come over here, you can either select from these mod packs that are already there. You have FTB, you have... Oh, oh, okay, you have FTB, all the mod packs from FTB. You have Microforge, uh, things. What's this? Okay, and this is Pixelmon. So you also have Pixelmon right over here. You have the AT launcher, you have Techit. So this consists of all the Tech Legends, Techit main. If you want to take a classic, you can type over, you can go over here, you can go over here and search take it, no, it's just take it, yeah, this one, this one is take it classic, so, now, if you want to in install a custom jar that is not over here, you're gonna type open mod, so, if you type open, it comes up over here, it's open mod, so, you open this up, and you have one directory, it's called open mod 1.0.0. So, I'm gonna have this selected, and over here, 7 days, this is a free plan, and just order it. Okay guys, so I faced some difficulties in making the free server, because I've already made any, a lot of free servers, and just deleted them. That's why I won't be able to make any more free servers, but these are my servers. So, once you have an open mod server, over here. So, if you want to reinstall a server, and put the open mod, you're gonna go to maintenance, and you're gonna come to factory default, and you're gonna click reinstall. And, and from here... You're gonna type, you see open mod, you select it, and just select it and click confirm, and it'll just reinstall it. And now, from the settings, from the FTP that you see over here, the FTP, there see, this is the password of FTP. From here, you can actually edit your, you can put the jar inside, so the spawn four jars over here. Uh, when you get the mod, you can put in the, your custom jar in, and I think you have to rename it to the jar that is already present. So, if I have a jar, called Minecraft servers. So one dot ten dot two. I'll take a jar of take a classic for example. And I'll rename it to Minecraft Server 1.2 and just replace it here and just start the server and that mod pack will open up. And that's how to install a Minecraft mod. Modded jar and a mod pack onto the servers of this thing. So if this tutorial has helped you, please like and subscribe. If you want me to do anything else Please go ahead and tell me in the comments and give feedback as well. So please, please, please just like and subscribe. Bye. And here is the. Woo!